Podcast Ranger. Welcome to Extra Extra Cast Ranger. Jesus, it's freezing in here. So turn off Aircaster. No, I'm liking it. Oh my god, there's five of us in here. Six. Spice Force five. There's five. I'll Aircaster, take all the you bastard. All right, let me tell you a story. We were talking about um, uh, in unfortunate names of things. So when I was in high school, I was all about drawing comics. So we'd have a ballpoint pen, and I'd just, would just draw comics on paper. And they were all superhero comics, because that's all I was reading. So I was really into the X-Men. And I had this idea that I wanted to make a team of people that sounded like X-Men. Oh, no. So I thought, okay, well, you know, I liked the word hypermen. I thought, no, that's too long. I'm going to call them high men. (laughs) (laughs) My mother and my sister just started laughing. (laughs) And they had this unspoken thing of like, should we tell them? (laughs) <laughs> we'll tell you when you're older, honey. Oh, so no. there's only one issue I ever drew of High Men. There's and only then they got promptly renamed. <laughs> there was only one High Men, and, and and then it was ruined. Oh well, they, there was uh, there was a big fight. They couldn't take their villain. Somebody broke the High Men. <laughs> <laughs> so and once they were broken, they were never really the same again. Yeah. Oh no! Come on, but, uh, that's just sh- terrible. <laughs> Yeah, so that, I, I, for my own defense, that was like two weeks ago. No, <laughs> no, it was, well, it was in grade school. No, in my own, yeah, my own defense, uh, I was 13 at the time. <laughs> and so now I'm 15. That's my story. So, but, oh yeah, go ahead, Lane. Uh, so in other news, they finally, at, like, it's funny, this week I was like, I was like, alright, this Thursday we're gonna get a review of the DX Shot Riser, I can't wait to fucking see it, and then, bam. Got the DX Shot Riser reviews. It's got some neat tunes in it. Fucking, I I love the thing. It's it's awesome. I just I'm sad that the belt's one of those fucking cheap like Sentai gimmick belt belts. Yeah. All it does is click a little switch on the back of the gun that tells it you're plugged into the belt now. Yeah. And all it does is go fever at the end of the Hisatsu. Yeah, and Valkyrie has like a weird handshake sequence. Which okay, yeah, let's talk about that. I'm pissed. <laughs> so apparently. Vulcan and Valkyrie henching differently in that Vulcan opens the key before putting it into the shot riser. And he just, he just tra- henching's having Shoot. it in gun mode. Whereas Valkyrie puts the key in while closed and then opens the key while it's in the gun because there's a little slot between the front and the back of the gun driver, dick gun belt. And I have no fucking idea why that's there. It's so completely pointless. Somebody should make sure. Somebody better make sure those stuntmen are on the same page. (laughs) So I feel like the only way to make that useful is if there's going to be like a a different kind of progress key later that utilizes this slot, just like a bigger one. I I just think it's so they have two different henchings, so they don't feel like they. It's so they don't feel the same, you know. And they could have just given her an orange one or a different. Transformation of No, because then you have to buy another shot riser just to do her. You say that like that wouldn't be something they would absolutely do. Eh, that's true. That just they maybe paint some shit before. But anyways, I'm excited for the bell. I can't wait to get it. I already have mine on its way, so yeah. And yeah, apparently based on what I'm seeing, it looks like there's a finisher well while it's in gun mode, and then there's a the different finisher when it's in the belt, which is the rider kick. Yeah, I like that it goes like shot rise. So what Ninja Turtles thing are we watching this week? Nothing! Nothing. Oh, shit. Yeah. Well, you we're mean not... I watched the rest of Last Mutation for no reason? Correct. Yeah. Oh. Did you enjoy Bone Steel? No, I'm just kidding. I, I never watched it. I know. Yet. I felt like calling you out. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I like but, the episode so where Raph and, Raph and Bone Steel are being chased by a gorilla. Yep. Voiced by Gary Chalk, I think. Are we still in no, Calabungus? Is it oh. still a thing? Sorry? Is it, are we, is it still Calabungus? Uh, technically? It's normal August now. Yeah, it's normal. Because uh, we're in we're in post Cowabungus. Is this like like Epilogabungus? Sure. Because Cow- I, I have I have something, Chris. Oh, oh right. yeah. I got I got I got something. Oh yeah. Are we ready for it? Sure. Mass Rider, Decatur Angelo. Oh my yeah. god. That's I like it's the camera. <laughs> yeah. good. I like how he's gripping a card between his like closed fist fingers. Ninja Turtle hands make no sense. Okay, so Emily, uh, since you were here for Galabungus, what do you what do you think of just Ninja Turtles in general? What do you think of them? I, this is it's, it's Ninja Turtles are way better than you think they would be with the title Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Is pretty much. The, I like Hero Turtles. 
You'll notice that I did the British version. Uh, he has no nunchucks whatsoever. Ah. You didn't give him tonfas, though. No, I gave him a camera. Ah, okay. Well, uh, that's, that's an equal weapon. It's yeah. a weapon of... Uh, Information. Yeah. It's, uh... He's gonna... Uh, what's the word I'm thinking of? I... My, Instagram? I, bra- I brain... He's gonna selfie? Propaganda! He's gonna propaganda you into submission. Yep. So... Our first story pretty much is something that Ichi's been wanting since day fucking one of us talking about Zio. Yeah, last week there was the hint about it, but now we have the official reveal of this DX Oma Zio driver. And apparently it's based it, off of a fish tree. Okay. Is it actually? I know that was the joke, but... It's based, I, I off, think, it's I, based off of a fish tree? The belt looks like fucking Taiyaki. Oh, no, I thought oh, you said fish treat. <laughs> yeah. I thought you said it's based off of a fish tree. And that That's what it sounded like he said. But yeah. By that. So we're getting the Z- DX Soma Z- belt. And it does not spin. No. Or, or accept you, you, ride you watches. Just, you, just, you just press the things in and then... But apparently it has finishers for all 20 Heisei riders. Oh, fuck. And also probably every single piece of dialogue Omazeo's ever said in the show. And then he Fucking also probably. Omazeo, so it's awesome. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah, I think it's supposed to look like that. So that's funny. Uh, yeah, so pressing the button, both the left and right buttons activated, it has the Omazeo Hisatsugeki, and then it has Legend Rider finisher sounds. And yeah, there's the art where it looks like Taiyaki. Oh, by the way, did, uh, I found nerd stuff at the CNE. We, oh, uh, Keyblades! We, we bought, we, I, we found a person selling Keyblades. Cool. For 20 bucks a piece. That's awesome. Nice! So we all, what are yeah. they made of? Like, plastic well, or Well, they've got some kind of plastic core, but they're foam. That's awesome! Yeah. I would have bought one. Do they work? Do they work? Can you well, open locks with them? I swung one accidentally at my friend and hit them in the forehead, and then oh, no. uh, in retaliation hit me in the nuts. So yeah, they work. <laughs> it unlocked my nuts. Yep. <laughs> no, never seen that. That's terrible. Uh, so yeah, the DX Omazeo driver, so unsurprisingly, is premium Bandai. Will be released in January, long after everyone stopped caring. <laughs> it will cost eighty-two fifty yen. So. It's still, it's cool they're making this belt. Yeah, it may not have as much playability as I was hoping, but yeah, the voice is badass and it's got it's a pretty good display piece. Yeah, I just think it's funny that it says twenty eighteen. Well, because yeah, because that's think... when he showed up and yeah, yeah. you know. Well, because it's just it's just technically it's just an evolved form of his belt. So, because, like, we saw I'll, the Ziku driver turn into the almost We'll driver. get into why that's disappointing. Oh, I have a counterpoint. Now, is it painted gold or is it gold plastic? It's probably gold plastic. Okay, then don't fucking buy it. Have oh. you heard of They still haven't fixed it. This is a thing that is ongoing. Like, for example, I didn't believe this. I went and got my Transmetal uh, uh, Megatron, or as you call him, Optimus. Um, <laughs> God damn it. And uh, he has the recorded. gold plastic, which is basically gold powder mixed with plastic. And you can literally flick it with your finger, and chunks come off. <laughs> well, because they started mixing this gold, uh, instead of like chroming something, which is to paint the gold on top of regular plastic, they started mixing this kind of like gold fleck paint into the, the plastic mix. And it looked really cool. But the problem is... is it that sheds. The, no, well, not no, it doesn't shed. It's that it doesn't... After a amount of time, when the plastic starts to kind of shrink a little bit, which plastic does, it becomes brittle. And Hel- the thing Hellfire is like, Chad is saying that uh, Bandai Gold doesn't do it. No? Okay, so they did fix it. Oh, and there's... Fi- I love how all the fan art I've been seeing of other Grand Zeo ride watches in the last week. Yeah, there's been a whole bunch of them. Oma Zeo with the Final Forms. And the Waz one. There was a, <laughs> one. There was a Soup one. Bless me. Oh, my God. All right, <sighs> so, yeah, that's neat. I will probably buy it. I'm getting sick because I'm getting sick of Zeo. Yeah. <laughs> sick of your shit. Next. We have some Zero One scans showing us some of the upcoming forms. Okay. Even though the show has... First thing... I'm mad, because we see all these forms, where the fuck is Freezing Bear? It'll be in the next patch. But we do get Punching Kong, which looks really cool. Is that a shark? Probably yeah. Punching Kong. So That's we're looking cool. at Zero One Biting Shark, uh, Zero One Flaming Tiger, and Vulcan Punching Kong. Yeah. Probably Wolf. He had me a shark. So- biting Shark! <laughs> Surging Shark. I, I love I, sharks. I, I know, but Wait, it's, what's, it's what's the gorilla? It's Punching Kong. I love sharks, but Punching Chris Kong. loves being wrong about Zeo. <laughs> we'll get to that. <laughs> but uh, it's really interesting because, as we can see through these forms, all of Zia or Zero One's forms 
involve the hopper armor, like, coming apart and reconfiguring, and then the new armor comes on top of it. Because if you look close, you can see, like, Rising Hopper's face on the side of That's Biting Shark. That's actually really cool. Reminds me of Deno in a way. A know, little bit, the, yeah. Yeah, the reforming. Uh, and then we got Flaming Tiger, which looks pretty rad. You know what I think it is, why that, that is how it is? It's because I think it's like he or it, it's like you're adding on to something. So yeah. it's like it's just like another layer. So like I feel like if he it's just like put, another layer of security. So like I'm, I'm I'm curious if he just put in Flying Falcon first before he did a Rising Hopper, would he just have like Flying Falcons? That I'm on? super curious to That'd see. That'd be actually cool if he did that. That Comrade or Knight? No, that's one of the monsters. That's Comrade like the bat. Onion. Comrade <laughs> Onion. Uh, but onion. I'm gonna say. I love the monsters for this season. It, they look so fucking good. Look at that! Look how awesome that is! Which okay. means we're gonna get a bat key as well. Oh. I, please? Turtle? Can we get a turtle key? Where's my owl? I'm on turtle form. Yeah, fucking owls too. I love owls. <laughs> no, no turtle form for zero one. <laughs> Um, I'm getting a bear form, so I'm happy with that. And then we've got Vulcan Punching Kong, which actually looks pretty good. Okay. Yeah. And it okay. solves my number one problem with the Vulcan shooting wolf form. It's not asymmetrical in a bad way. Okay, I want to say this. I thought that was a zero one form. <laughs> I mean, that's what we thought when we first when we talked about the first set of scans. But oh, if you I, look at his eyes, you can tell it's yeah, Vulcan I, and not I zero one. I realized it was Vulcan until Link told me. I'm like, oh. oh, so you can see the dick belt gun on his. Yeah, also that. <laughs> okay. Who says fudge owls? <laughs> Tarawat, apparently. That's in Dr. Tarawat? <laughs> you don't bring him up around here. Why not? No, that's that's change. my catchphrase. Yeah, that's what something you said before. I'm the one that came up with fuck owls. I fuck owls. Wait, no. <laughs> that's that's my catchphrase. If he's marketed that, then uh, he owes me some sweet sweet scratch. Oh. <laughs> also, I noticed something that like apparently all the reviewers fucking didn't notice that the the shooting wolf. When you press it, the button a second time, it says werewolf's ability. Uh, yeah, I did notice Everyone's that. like, oh, wolf's ability. I'm like, no, it's saying werewolf's ability. But it says wolf on the key. I know. So, so now we have a fucking inconsistency maybe already. Maybe werewolf's maybe, ability. Maybe they just misplaced it. Where's wolf's ability? <laughs> I mean, I mean, I love I love werewolves, so. Like, it's my favorite movie monster. Yeah. Where's uh, up? Oh, Gar is off the floor. Hey, he's going in the kitchen. Grab me a... <laughs> Kool Aid Jammer while you're there. <laughs> What's in What's your pants? Kool Aid Jammer. It's uh, like a, a juice pouch. Do I have one? Uh, sure. Come on and slam and I'll welcome grab, to the I'll jam. Grab two. <laughs> Get some for the whole class. It's blue wagon. Because I only once had a Capri Sun as a kid, and I opened it so spectacularly wrong, they never let me have another one. Like yeah. Because like I, I I stabbed it too hard and it punctured and then shot it all in my face. Oh my god. I was... This was a week ago. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so here we have some information on the enemies and monsters of the week. Okay. Sorry. I gotta you point like, this out. You like glitched your eyes? Fucking zooming on the fucking mantis little guy over here. Oh my god. Holy shit. Fucking male stripper over here. It, it, it might in fact be a descendant of hard gay. No, that's oh, not shit, I haven't thought about hard game in years. <laughs> um, but okay, so apparently this is delightful, right? Yeah. yeah. Have a Kool-Aid jammer today. Oh yeah. <laughs> so the the villain organization Metsubojinrai.net, uh, they reprogram human gears via belts called Zetsumerizers, which is Japanese for extermination risers, and the evil versions of the progress keys that they use are called Zetsuma Rise Keys. So you know they're going to start releasing those too, and we can see them, some of them in these scans. And they're broken. They look cracked, which means that they're probably going to get reprogrammed and fixed by the writers. Yep. But yeah, look look at all these forms. They look so cool. We have a Mantis. I think that's Falcon. Uh, a Bat. I think that's a Rat. I, I'm not sure what that top left was. The is. Monkey. The Beetle. <laughs> Yeah, and, and I mean, uh, here's the the henching sequence for all three of them. So, as we can see, Vulcan he transforms just holding the gut, the shot riser, and then Valkyrie she has it in the belt. Because we have to differentiate them somehow. I, uh, no, I like that. One I'm glad them, they're doing that. One of them is practicing proper gun safety. <laughs> Only one of them is strapping it to their dick. 
No. Only one of them has a dick. <laughs> Are these the same person? We'll, we'll let they, you decide. You know what? They both might. I didn't ask. Right? <laughs> yes, I, I am totally super on board for Valkyrie Vulcan, so... They're gonna be an awesome team. Are we gonna call them as a duo Volkery? So what what are we calling that color of zero one? Oh, I actually looked it up. Green. It's uh, neon green. According to the wiki, it's chartreuse yellow. Uh, you know that's a I very gay it? color. Baby shit Whoa. green. Whoa. That's pretty judgmental. It's a joke from a musical that I attended. Okay. I wasn't paying attention. Attended. Not musical. But anyways, <laughs> uh, I call it. It was called a star baby shit Wars green. Where like, like they, they made the joke that chartreuse is such a gay color, only gay people know like the the name of the actual color. Oh, so well, then gay people wrote the, the wiki. Or should sure we say gay? I, don't, I, always, I always called it highlighter it's yellow because it looks like a highlighter. Well, the lady chartreuse, who was a uh, franco Ruckin paint, I don't know. I'm space <laughs> My bullshit meter is not set. <laughs> yeah. Neat. But yeah, the lady chartreuse. Uh, but yeah, I was calling it highlighter yellow, but according to the wiki, which I will trust their authority on this, it's chartreuse. Because I the wiki. You're saying highlander yellow. Chartreuse. Yes. There can only be zero one! <laughs> oh no, that actually Nailed it. worked. That's a good one. Alright, next news story. We have scans from Ryu Soldier showing us Yay. the new upcoming Kishi Ryu, which are kangaroo themed. Alright, let's see this. Wait, kang? Wait, Wait that... why are they kangaroo themed? Because punches! But, 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 dinosaur? It's, sure. It's a dinosaur. It, it's, it's not a kangaroo. Or, sorry, I think... <laughs> it's, one of the names is punchy Guru. Sorry, packy Guru. It's a packy packy cephalosaur. Yeah. Why, why did you get kangaroo? Because what they're named P packy Guru and chibi Guru. Well, I'm sorry. Like they look kind of kangaroo-like. I, I don't, I don't know. They're like, bouncing there. Are, are, are you saying it, kangaroos were dinosaurs? It's kind of the new Bunpaki. They have tiny hands. Bunpaki! Uh, yeah, so we got Pachi Guru and Chibi Guru, which and of course the armor looks fucking form. ugly on Riesel Red. Oh god, it's like, like vomit look, green. No, it's army green. Yeah, it's so vomit green. It's it would look good. It would look so much better on Riesel green or that Riesel like black. The that I drew on that turtle. Riesel <laughs> black. Riesel black definitely. Honestly, Riesel black just looks good with any armor. I mean, you, if you put this on green, it might. If you put this on green, it might look good. By the way, did anyone watch? I watched the first episode of the new Dark Crystal. Not yet. Not Holy yet. shit! Don't say anything. Oh, there's there's a shot of Pocky on uh, blue and pink for some reason. That doesn't look good on either of them. Yeah, it's craptastic. Uh, it, oh yeah, and the soul that it uses is called the Dashin soul, which means stomping, I guess. Uh, I wonder if they had to trade to get that. Yeah, and then also during I the month this week's episode. during the month of September, we will meet a new member of the Ryu Soul Tribe named Nada, who is a veteran <laughs> warrior. Yeah, he's full of Nada, and a potential successor for Ryu Soul Red. Oh, Nani? Oh, are we gonna swap Red Rangers? Oh, please, yeah, I, I have no problem with that. So you've been my kid cuisine, you. I mean, okay, <laughs> okay. Is Not that, that I don't like Ko. Like, Ko is... Oh, Ko's, is that what his name is? Ko, yeah. yeah. Ko is fine. He's, I can't remember it. I'm gonna call him Crandall. I Ko mean, is fine, but, like, he's not the greatest. He's not Cage. I, I will say, that in this week's episode, he showed off the, a unique ability he has that I will give him some credit for. It was pretty cool. We'll get I, to that. He's so boring, I don't even have a nickname for him. I have a nickname for every other one of those. You're like, do. Like, oh, Bomba <laughs> I call Rock Splitter. Cause fuck that rock. Oh, I'm probably stabbing Bomb. Oh my god. Okay, if anyone in the chat knows what I'm talking about, just that face fucking Bomba made in this week's episode. I need, <laughs> I need a still of that. The one you oh, already. Oh, oh you okay. can. You already made a meme of this I, one. I, I have it handy. Hang on. I almost took the screen cap and just took the <laughs> Fucking. I didn't know Bomba could emote right? like that. It was amazing. The best thing ever. Bomba, <laughs> that, this still is why. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Why Bamba is the best character in the show? <laughs> when someone says that stabbing people isn't the answer, 
Did you see the meme I made of it? Yeah. When you re- when you read the joke, no jumping allowed. <laughs> when you realize the new episode is a clip show. <laughs> yeah, when that hit me, it was like. Oh, oh god, they're gonna realize I'm a fraud. Fan, f- fan, cast their fans go to town. <laughs> Hell, put Thomas' face on. When no. they don't. No, put Lane's face on. When they, no. Their look when you don't give them back to their son. <laughs> <laughs> they look when you stab the rock. Give me back my son! Give me back my rock! Alright, next. Bandai fashion, Kamen Rider driver belt buckles. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we're gonna do for Wait, 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 wait. No, drive, driver, don't give a shit. Well, it's the it's Kugan a decade. I want belts on, though. Well, let me see. Oh, I, let me see him. Let me see. Which one would I go for? So we got Kuga, Agito, Yuki, Fives, Blade, Kiwi, Go, Dan, Okiva, Dang it, so just the first ten haste. You know what? I, I would actually, for all those, I, I would take the uh, the Hibiki belts because like it look, translates the best, I think, into that style. Uh, I'd say. Are we going to guess how much they're worth? I'm guessing $75. I'm going to say 90 per each per buckle. I'm going to say and, don't care. Emily, do you have a guess? Um, I think I'm, I'm aiming towards where Lane is. Well, pick a number. What would say? You always seriously? Ninety. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just say one dollar. Yeah, ninety. <laughs> oh, you're gonna do one dollar? <laughs> All right. So the bu- 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 bu, let's see. Each book, each bill bungle costs forty-one eighty yen. So Emily wins. Emily yeah. wins for a dollar. <laughs> for one. You always win. You always just win if you have a dollar. You're closest without going over. <laughs> You're that one, the one dollar guy. There's always one in every episode. Know, and, 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 and everyone I, rolls their eyes, but then he and wins. I never yeah, want, it I works. I wanted to ever be that guy. And then but the worst would be like if, if like, it's like ninety dollars. You're like ninety one dollars. And I just look at you like, just like, well, I'm looking at you like Bomba. It's the video. It's the game show equivalent of camping. You may hate it, but it works. Uh, but, but yeah, in terms of these, if I were to get one, I'd probably get the Kiva one, because the best thing about that version of a rider belt is it's also your best friend. Yep. Oh. <laughs> what, what if just, what if just at the end, like, Kiva's just like, well, all through we did. Shut the fuck up, I hate you. <laughs> You're only good for transforming. <laughs> oh. But what about those bats? Yeah, I didn't ask you to bathe with me. Bite my dick and transform me. Shut <laughs> 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 ah! up! Yeah. Uh, yeah. All right. So yeah, it's just cool. Got a decade. Buckles. Is, Yay! I don't know why. Just buy them. The decade one where to work. You know what? At that price, it's almost worth. it. I've seen t- much terribly priced rider merch. Well, you know what? Uh, that one I will say it's still a bit high, but it's within reason. Yeah. We need rider scrunchies. That'd be that sell. Yeah. You could buy these and make them scrunchies. <laughs> no. Uh, these belt buckles will be shipping in December for anyone who's interested. However, being that I probably have to replace, because it's probably like I'll get it with the does it come with the belt attached? Uh, looks like it. I don't know. I, I'm a I'm a large gentleman, so to be yeah. like I do, and it wouldn't get halfway. I was, I was gonna say me having a preference is only under the like zero zero one percent chance that I'd even call it right zero one percent. Oh look, Ichi, you can get a DX Kiva Kiva belt for fucking two hundred and seventy two dollars on Amazon. Oh joy! Yeah, <laughs> the joy of related ad links. Next! Uh, so apparently an online bookstore called Book Live aired a new commercial featuring Kentaro Ito as a tokusatsu hero called Book Live Man. What the fuck? What's in the commercial. head? It's like a candy, like a gashapon machine. Okay. Because he's got the dial on his Wait, chest. Is this an actor that we're supposed to know? I don't know, Wait, but what's it's his name? Kentaro Ito. Like I don't know. Uh, oh, okay, here. He has been in the Netflix series Terrace House. He starred in Good Morning Call, which features Shunya Shiraishi from Wizard and Dori Sakurada from Denim. So he's been writer-actor adjacent. <laughs> Wait, what? How do you spell his last name? I-T-O. Kentaro Ito? Yeah. yeah. So, apparently in this commercial, he reads a manga on his smartphone, mentions how he wants everyone to read manga with great value, and then uses his smartphone to transform into Book Live Man, and uses his new form to dispense discounts uh, out of his Gashapon machine head into a crowd. All so right. he's the sixth ranger of Chojin Sentai Live Man. Sure. Book Live Man. Yeah, Book Live. Yeah. <laughs> I, 
Uh, oh, yeah. On, on a note related to, I think last week we were talking about uh, Dan Caroto um, interviewing stars. I actually found some of them. Oh, yeah? His English is actually very good. Cool. Maybe we should make those a topic. Yeah. Well, I, I, you can't... Well, don't go to the website I watch them on because I think my phone now, you know, now has a Wish membership. Oh. <laughs> and apparently there are singles in my area. Holy shit, he's mine. It's one of those things where it's like, it's like you've got... Is he the, one of the singles? you got the video on the screen and it's like... Is this the play button or is this the launch porn hub? Oh yeah, I know those you know, sites. And you're just, so but the thing is, his English. It's like yeah, it's, he's got a strong accent, but I mean, it's better than some people I know, like that I you know work with. You know, like, cool. Like it is like he's he's an intelligent guy. He's picking it up. He's getting good. Sick. And when he's given the toys, they look at him like he's fucking insane. <laughs> well, he is. You know, like the, because the thing is, he's not handing them. Common Rider again. Yeah. He's handing them Dan figures Carotto. of Dan Kuroto with his arms crossed mm. on a fucking Nintendo pipe. <laughs> and he also tells them that this is God Dan Kuroto and that he is to be worshipped. <laughs> that's awesome. He's saying this to like Brad Pitt, Leonardo. Yeah, and they're, and they're just like, whatever, dude. That's 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 cool. Uh, are we done? Yep. <laughs> cool, <laughs> Book Live Man! Next! Yeah. So, apparently, one of the storyboarders for Comrade Zio, Shoma Muto, has shared some designs for other Another Writers that they drew in their spare time. Didn't he fight Godzilla? No, Shoma no, Muto? No, 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 no. Muto? What? In the... I know Yugi Moto. No, Muto. That's the name of the uh, the monster. The, the creatures in the 2014 the... Godzilla. Yeah. No idea. Gar? Ichi, Ichi's never seen the 2014 Godzilla movie. I don't watch things. You got seven minutes. I can show you every Godzilla scene. Oh, <laughs> no. So apparently we, got, we were possibly going to get another Riders Cross, Chalice, and Mock. And go on, click on Cross. That's just fucking awesome looking. That's cool. Love that. I like it better than the act than the regular one. <laughs> uh, let's see, Chalice. Chalice looks not Oh, that's bad. so cool. I love like, the arm just, sight. He just looks like a more monster. I don't like the weird him. face at the corner there. And then, <laughs> it's a zoom in. Muck. That's great. That's pretty good. That's I love the wheel as an eye. It's like Soul, soul Edge's eye. And look at the fucking Zenrin shooter. Now it's a fucking bonehead. Shit. These are, these are pretty good. It's so good. That's awesome. What could have been... Well, we got some good ones, though. Oh, yeah, no. The, honestly, the, the consistently great and terrifying designs of the Another Riders... Like another ghost is, actually freaked me ...is out. probably the best thing about Zeo, is how they were all great. There wasn't a bad one in them. Nope. Yeah. Uh, they, they, and here's where Gar tells us who, what he thinks was a bad one. Which one? Uh, another decade. No, no, I'll get to that. You know what? I'm gonna say one of them was shit. Oh, the, Kuda. Exactly, because it was a fucked up CG monster. Actually, yeah, no, I wish yeah. they would have had like a proper Kuga. I, I appreciate that they did something different with it. Like, yeah, I, well, I wish there was. Well, you know what the greatest one was? Part, another Agato. Agreed. See, I love that guy. See, another Kuga I can respect for being what it was because it's supposed to be, oh, he's like the first Heisei Rider, so of course he'd be like more powerful, so he's yeah. more monstrous. Emily, do you have any thoughts? You haven't said anything in a while. I know, I, I don't really know what to say. Well, you watch Zeo along with us, what do you think? About, about... About the other Riders. Well, which other Riders, riders rider. do you like? Which ones do you not like? I don't know, I thought they were really neat. General, another build actually made a pretty big impact from the beginning just because of the eye movements. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking, it was Zio, another Zio, another Zio 2 and Drive for me. This, I loved and I loved another Geno another, another because it looks good. like nothing else I've ever seen. Another, it had horns coming out of its goddamn eyes. If, if I honestly had to pick one I didn't like, another decade, it was just too much. He's too horny. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You know what the funny thing is? It reminds me. Remember that time that monster henchened in with the DN driver? Oh, in the yeah. Kino Monaco. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That was kind of I'm shocked we didn't get that as another yeah. DN. That would have been great. Because that oh, literally because that would have been the dumb joke. They did it with Agito. 
Well, that made Any, sense. Anyways, if I had to pick one of the another writers I didn't like, it would probably be another Exade, just because I didn't like that they tried to make his hair look like hair. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like predator hair. Well, yeah. Next! Yeah, anyways, next. The Toei YouTube channel is apparently going to begin streaming Ghost Sager. Go cool. watch Ghost Sager. It's a really good Sentai. It's in the top five of the decade. Wait, they That's are sad. actually streaming something for North American viewers. No, no, it's region locked. So, oh, so you can only watch it. Fire time. up your VPNs, folks. Why, when I could go watch the entire show of Blu-ray Rip? I literally have downloaded it the other day. That was a suggestion. Wait, are, we, are we allowed to talk about torrenting on this channel? Whatever. I TV Nihon the whole fucking thing. Well, yeah. Oh, yeah. TV Nihon? That's TV Rip. Go for Blu-ray Rip or Bus. If I watch them on my phone. The Blu-ray Rip doesn't open correctly. These okay, guys. TV Nihon's worth it, man. <laughs> also, yeah. Fire up your TV Nihon's! Go say it's your Start really your Nihon! <laughs> you, can take your, you can take your Blu-ray rips and shove them up your ass! So, I'm watching TV Nihon! Do we know, do we know who's dubbing, or who's, sorry, who's subbing uh, Zero One yet? Is it going to be Overtime? I know TV Nihon's. I expect Nihon and Overtime, Overtime will both throw their hats back Remember in. Remember Acer subs? Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, you mean overtime subbers uh, going over to sub guy? Yeah. Oh, fruit samurai. That's gonna be real warring. Oh. Shit. No, I remember when they were like, "We're not gonna sub the guy movie." Yeah, we got better things to do. Man, like, I remember somebody saying that it was gonna be the worst series that they're ever gonna do, and it's gonna get canceled. Ah! And then I guy, remember somebody saying and then that. Guy, well, because yeah, when we saw what the suits were, we we're like, ah. And then the second I said, when somebody said Fruit Ninja, just like that's 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 kind of dumb. Fruit Samurai. And, fruit Samurai. And then when I remember I was at Con Bravo, and somebody walked up to me. I forget who it was. It might have no, it was Cell. Walked up to me because hey Tom, check this out. And he's got like this really shitty low res JPEG, but it like it was official looking. And he showed that to me. And this picture guy in the stand, and I was like, I'm in. <laughs> and, then, and, and then guy. Hundred and ten percent. And then guy just ended up being a fucking amazing show. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. God tier. It's not perfect, but it's but it's fucking, fucking God tier. tier. <laughs> All right. Anyway, so yeah, the Ghost Sager series is going to start being broadcast on the Toy Tokusatsu YouTube channel. You Two episodes right. every week on Friday. All right. I could binge watch that entire show in a week. Is it's good though? It's I, I, oh, I it's it. so fucking good. How much do you get that robot guy there? I, I Go like say night. Go say yeah. night. Uh, as much as every six ranger does. Isn't he like a bending machine? <laughs> what? No, 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 you're thinking of Tet's, uh, you're thinking of, um, the arcade cabinet guy. Okay. Te Tetsu or something. I just, yeah. I just think he's bad. I mean, there's a talking, like, vending machine. Yeah, hang on, hang on. Ten Data Tenso from Ghost Ager. As long as it's not Tensu. Tenso. <laughs> Kelsey, I made that joke earlier. Also the oh, oh my god, since, since the Mega Man Zero ZX collection's coming out, we can we can hear fucking Tenso. Oh my god! Okay, no, that's not, this isn't related at all, but kind of, because, oh my god, they fucking announced the Mega Man Zero ZX collection for Switch! I'm so happy! Okay. We no, get it, fucking Kamen Rider Mega Man on Switch! Okay, no, it was Datus. His name's okay. Datus. Look, I, look I'm, at that cute motherfucker. Oh my god. Look how cute yeah, he yeah, is. Yeah, talking vending machine. He's an arcade cat. He's a gobberizing he's machine. Or he's a go-getter Dr. Wily. But no, I'm, okay. Anyone, any of our Tokusatsu fans who like Mega Man, you must play Mega Man ZX and ZX Avenue because it's fucking... Mega Man Kamen Riders! It's, it's really good. And then in ZX, it's my favorite! In ZX Advent, you, like, kill bosses, and then you can turn into the bosses. Yeah, you can basically kaijin ride. Fucking Ice Crocodile was so cool. Bifrost? Yeah. You fucking took up half the screen! <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I'm getting that on Switch. Fuck awesome. yeah! And they even made, they made like, easy mode, you can mid-stage save, and fucking, they, like, better graphic made it, like, filters. yeah, better graphic filters, but you can also switch it back to, like, Pixel graphics, if you want. So, all right, go buy it. January twenty twenty. Next, hi Blaze. Welcome. Uh, so Seiji Takaiwa, who is retiring from being the lead role suit actor, uh, posted a tweet thanking his fans for their support. And yeah. now, if you excuse him, oh, that's a cool he picture. needs to go sleep. He hasn't <laughs> slept in the last nineteen years. <laughs> Uh, well, we got a little nap after he was murdered in the stairwell in Ghost. <laughs> he got a quick, he got a hot. Oh yeah, Jiro. 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 Uh, yeah, so the translation of his tweet is, After yesterday's final broadcast of Zio, 
We have received many greetings and praises from all of you. To all the Kamen Rider and Super Sentai actors and staff whom I've worked with in the past 18 years, they have also sent a lot of messages congratulating us. I would like to use this opportunity to each and every one of you in return. Again, thank you very much. Aww. So, as per the news we had previously, he is passing the torch to Yuya Nawada, who is suiting up as their one. So, yeah. thanks again for your amazing years of dedication, Mr. Kamen Rider. Thank you, Seiji Takaiwa. Does that mean Seiji Takaiwa will come back as Red Rangers? That'd be cool. I mean, so, he was Magi Red, Kaku Red, um, or Ninja Red, sorry. Yeah, Ninja Red. Um, he was Time Red and Go Red and Ginga Red. And then he was the blue bee fighter and the green yeah. bee fighter. Cool. That's right. interesting to know. All right. Oh, yeah, he was Doras in the Zeto movie. Oh, boy. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Sorry. Quick fucking shout. So some guy was fucking shitting on the Zeto movie. And I, like, a lot of people were going, like, no, fuck you. Zeto is actually a pretty good movie. Like, fuck that guy. Zeto was. I liked the Zeto movie. I thought it was good. <laughs> <laughs> Are we still doing those? Hey, we hey, got a month. We ha- yeah, we have a month. Or 20 days. It's gonna happen. Let's go in the mouth, guys. Fucking air, nothing, hashtag no one can stop. They can't Ulk, stop all of us. Ulks rans at Area 51. <laughs> sure. My only wish is that someone live streams everyone getting mowed down. I, hope I just hope they're all in, like, groups. Like, uh, the people have been making jokes in, like, meme compilations where, like, there's the Naruto runners. <laughs> and then, like, I want there to be, like, you know, like, the, the, the Henshi belt people who have like the belts and they're like hey shit and that's all the time we're giving that topic next Aww. comrade zeo and zero and baton touch events yeah. oh my goodness they touch batons care. gross <laughs> yeah. you know what's better huh uh the ultraman passing torch because people shed tears of that man yeah people fucking cry at that shit but then now we have to wait for someone to sub the new show but then there's the red the red ranger crossover <laughs> which is always good ah ah what it's the fake, fake homemade Zio. <laughs> Zero one complete? I don't know. Yeah. Anyway, so yeah, a baton touch event was held in Tokyo to signal the changing of the guard from Zio to Zero one. Okay. Okay. So it goes just like, hey, bye. <laughs> here, ha- here, have this baton. I don't know why they don't do like what they do in Sentai. They have an actual like, handoff? Yeah, like in the bumper. That'd be neat. So I yeah. I guess that's Sentai's thing. Uh, Okuno, who played uh, Zio uh, at the event, mentioned that it was a treasure to have met nice staff, nice cast, and nice viewers through the roles of Zio and Silver Tokiwa. Thank you for your support the past year. He cried himself to sleep every night. <laughs> I had so many good ideas for the show, but they never went They with didn't them. listen to a single one. I was a huge Kamen Rider fan, and, every, and I let them all down. <laughs> I am sorry. <laughs> Fun. Uh... Yeah, Corey oh, has. sweet. On a DS. anime game. <laughs> anyway, that's the news. Oh, no. No, there's one more piece of news. Uh-oh. Oh. What I got it? my Goldar figure. Yeah, he did. That's oh, news. Sweet. It's so fucking good. It's pretty gold. Yeah. I wish it was darker in color, but... It'll oh, look. sweet. Griffozer. I mean, Gar, all you need <laughs> to do is just watch Bruno's fucking painting tutorials and you should be able to do it yourself. Yeah, I'm like, I, I don't... Like to custom? Maybe if I had a second one. Also, uh, other news story. Taiga opening came out. Go listen to it. It's yeah. really good. R- Buddy Steady Go. It's a good, good song. Voice by Ultraman Taiga. Yeah, no, Ichi, or literally. The thing, the thing... <laughs> the thing... <laughs> Buddy Steady Go! <laughs> no, so the thing, the thing that the main character actually yells out when he's transforming into Ultraman Taiga is he, he goes, Buddy Go! <laughs> Go. So, someone watched Go Busters. And he mentions with... Hey, let's go, with, buddy. Let's he go, he let's mentions go with keychains. I'm not your buddy, man. He, 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 he uses keychains and bracelets. That's how he does shit. Anyways, that's extra extra. Bye. We'll see you on the next episode of Kaiju Sentai Ultra Ranger. It, it has Gridmans. Yeah, we have Grid- Gridman. Everyone loves Gridman. Se- several Gridmans. Is that the one with, with, uh, with the Martin Lawrence? Yeah. Well, that's Superhuman Samurai Cyber Squad. Bye. Bye.